Hi and welcome to this DC Builder tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a split screen video using Magic's Movie Edit Pro. Okay, so on my desktop I've got this folder and inside this folder I've got two video clips which I downloaded from Pixabay. I'll put links to those in the YouTube description. Let's open up Magic's Movie Edit Pro and we'll take these two video clips and drag them to the timeline. We need to stack them so I'm going to put this clip underneath like this and then we'll click on this bottom clip and we'll go over to the effects control panel and click on size and position here. So you see as you scroll down, you'll see size and position. Now it's the left position here that we need to affect. Basically we need to divide 1080 by 2. So that will be 960. So we type in 960 here, we'll split the screen like this. If we click play, we'll see this video playing on this side and this video playing on this side. So you can reverse that logic by simply reversing the video clips clicking on the original one, setting that to a value of zero, and then clicking on the bottom one, and setting that to 960. And you can split it in the other direction, like this. So that's how you do a split screen video, it's very, very simple. I use it sometimes when I'm looking at showcasing two different pieces of work. I think it's quite an effective way to do that. Um, really, normally I would move my timeline to the end here and cut it, and then you could do a transition and have another split screen running afterwards so in theory what you could do is copy this one click it copy it and paste it here and drag it up and then select this one copy and paste it and drag it to the bottom so you could switch the split screen right so you could click on this one let's move on the timeline let's see we'll set this one to a value of zero and then this one here we'll set it to 960 so now they will be playing on the opposite, they'll switch over like this, right? So that might be a nice effect. We could add a transition between them. So we could select these two and we could drag it across a bit, maybe about this much. And then when we click play, they'll cross fade like this. So I think that's a good effect and a good way to do that. Okay, let's save this. That's how you go about doing a split screen video using Magic's Movie Edit Pro. Let's minimize this and close this folder. I hope you find this tutorial useful. I look forward to seeing you in the next DCP web tutorial.